Matt, your 200th start on the DP World Tour, your first victory, how does it feel? Yeah, it's incredible. Um, it's not quite sunk in yet. You know, I've played great all week. Um, it's been testing at times. I was in control all week. Not quite as in control today, I don't think, but, you know, I've, I've got the job done and I'm absolutely made up. You graduated from the Challenge Tour last year. What does it mean to get a victory this early on in the season? Yeah, it changes everything. You know, I can I can plan a schedule now. I can uh, take weeks off here and there, knowing that I can play DP World Tour next season. Um, there's events that I wasn't going to get in, which I now will. Uh, you know, and I, I, I can't wait to get going again. What pleased you most about your performance out there throughout what was a tough week? Um, I think the fact that I just hit really nice shots under under what what I would consider as pressure. I mean, you know, I, the only person you put pressure on yourself is, is yourself. So um, my expectations were were level, and you know, I controlled it quite well. You built up a big lead. How did it feel coming down 18? A bit surreal, to be honest. It was uh, yeah. I, I never dreamt that I would be able to enjoy playing the 18th hole, uh, you know, or the 72nd hole of a, of, a, of, a, of a DP World Tournament, knowing that I was going to win. Um, like I said, it's not quite sunk in yet, so I'm sure it will do tomorrow or a couple of days. And just in general, how much are you now looking forward to the rest of the season? Yeah, I can't wait. Um, proves proves a lot to me. It proves that I'm, I'm good enough to be out here. Um, you know, I've had plenty of doubts over that of that over the last few years. Um, like you said, I graduated last year. Um, just proves everything to me, really. And uh, you know, it's been a it's been a tough 12 months. From stepdad died last May. Um, you know, this is for him, really. Fantastic. Thank you very much, and well done. Thank you.